welcome, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to the channel. Welcome if you're new. And my name is Zaire and this is my channel, Multi-Layered. And I just wanna quickly get into this story time uh, slash testimony slash walking in faith story. But before we get into that, make sure you like, make sure you subscribe, and make sure you turn on your bell notifications so that you're notified when I upload. So without further ado, let's just get into the video. All right, so if you've been rocking with me for a while and you have seen my, my journey as an entrepreneur, you've probably seen this video and I'll link it up here or up here, I don't know which side, but you've probably seen it where God just led me to shut down my business and just pause everything, right? And if you haven't, watch that video so that you can get context for here. So after God told me to like pause everything, shut down everything, um, I was honestly like really hurt because I just felt like everything, every time I tried to do this, I tried to work on my business, I tried it actually in my own strength, like I would fail and I wouldn't understand. And it was just like, I got the word from God, like, hey, yeah, you're supposed to do this business, but it felt like it just kept on failing. And after after I closed the closed down the, the shop and like shut it off, closed it from customers, I like really was just reflecting. And I was honestly asking God, like, okay, maybe you're calling me to business, but not this one. So maybe I just have to shut this down completely and just start over or or yeah just pivot into another type of business so i was asking him questions about like should i shut the business down should i um should i give away the hoodies that i made like it was a lot of questions but right around april i believe that's when i posted that video like yeah i didn't get the piece to do that i just i didn't get any answer so i just left it alone and it wasn't until October, I remember I was praying and I was like, Jesus, like these boxes with the hoodies are taking up like a decent amount of space. So should I, should I let them go? Should I give them away to the Salvation Army? Should I give them away to some homeless people around me? Like, should I just give it to my family? Like I was asking him all these questions and he was just like, no. And I'm like, what you mean? No, like I have this, these hoodies are taking up a decent amount of space. And like, I just wanted to make room for the new, like whatever the new was for my business, I just wanted to make room for the new. And I was just like, I have to do something with these hoodies. Mind you, they're printed, packaged, everything. Like they, they were brand new hoodies that were packaged to sell. So I was just like, what am I gonna do with packaged to sell hoodies? And I was just like entertaining, I was just entertaining him. I was like, you want me to sell these hoodies? And I felt like he was like, yeah, sell them. I was like, all right, let's see. So you want me to sell them for like $20 each, like half price, more than half price? He was like, no, don't sell them for $20. I was like, so how much am I gonna sell them for? Like the full price? And I felt like he was like, yeah, sell them for full price. And I was like, wait, hold on. You telling me to sell these hoodies again after I did these launches two times, not once, but two times, and they both failed. You trying to tell me to, to sell these hoodies again? And I felt like he was telling me, yeah. And I was like, hold on. This is giving me like cast your nets again. And I just want to read the, the scripture that he gave me in that moment. All right, so Luke 1, I keep on saying Luke 1. Maybe somebody should be reading Luke 1, but Luke 5, verse 1 to 5. And this is the King James Version. And it says, And it came to pass that as the people pressed upon him to hear the word of God, he, Jesus, stood by the lake of Gethsemane, I think that's how you say it, and saw two ships standing by the lake. But the fishermen were gone out of them and were washing their nets. And he entered into one of the ships, which was Simon's, also known as Peter, and prayed him that he would thrust out a little from the land. And he sat down and taught the people out of the ship. Now when he had left speaking, he said unto Simon, launch out into the deep 
and let down your nets for a draught, also known as a catch. And Simon answered, said, answer and said unto him, Master, we have toiled all the night and have not have taken nothing. Nevertheless, at thy word, I will let down the net. Okay, so in that moment when I was praying, like that scripture was placed on my heart and I felt like Jesus was like, cast your nets again. I did this twice. I did this twice and they both failed. The first launch didn't sell much, didn't sell much, didn't sell anything on the first day and didn't sell much after that. Second launch, very similar, didn't sell much and it wasn't like productive or fruitful and it didn't look like God's hands were on it. So I was just like, all right, I got it. Obviously I, I missed the mark with this. So I got to just start all over. But like it back in October, Jesus was like, cast your nets again. At this point, I was like, at this point, if you're saying this, Jesus, okay. 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 Because you know how you've gone through so much pruning that you don't even have like pride to hold on to. Like, that's how I feel right now. I'm just like, all right, nevertheless, if you say so, Jesus, I'll do it. And it's funny enough, like I prayed uh, and asked, okay, all right, Jesus, like, should I fix the website so it's a little bit more appealing, a little bit more updated, everything. And he was like, no, keep everything the same. And I think it's very intentional that he did it that way because... I can't get the glory out of anything because everything stayed the same, except this time Jesus gave the command to let down my nets. And I'm just living by faith right in front of y'all. I'm walking by faith. And, and like God told me to post this video and I don't know what the catch is going to look like in the, the scriptures. It was good, but I don't know about me. Like, cause I asked like, Am I going to sell out or is this just going to be a few? And it was, I didn't get an answer. So I'm literally here walking by faith and not by sight. And it's like, I, I'm learning that like, God uses my life as an example to other people as other people are examples to me. And I feel like this is also a call to people to let down your nets again, but this time with Jesus. Go back to the drawing board, but with Jesus and see where he would have you pick up what you put down or what was a, what was a failure before, whether it is that job, whether it was getting that degree, whether it was moving to the new state, whether it was, um, what you call it, getting that LLC, getting that, that, um, that licensing, whatever it was this time, this time around, do it with Jesus. And not just partially do it with Jesus. Let him drive the boat. Because for me, I feel like I wasn't somebody who was like, no, like, God, you're completely out of this. You're completely out of this. It was for, more so like I would let him drive some parts, but then other parts. I'm like, all right, God, I got it from here. And it was just like, no, he's either in the boat completely or he's out of it. It's not like you don't get to pick and choose when he bless what he blesses. He wants to be if you want to bless it, he wants to be the whole thing. And at this point, I'm just like, all right, God, whatever you have for me with this, okay. And it's so funny. I saw this post today, um, right after I came out of prayer, just asking like, will I sell sell out or will I uh, will it just be like a little bit of sales or what's good? Uh, I saw this post and I'm gonna post it up here. And it's from Paris. I'm going to link her, her channel below. But it was basically saying like, you, you I, I got to pull up. I forgot the, the, I forgot the exact quote because I don't have it in front of me. But it was essentially saying, you will get the reward after you act in obedience. You will get your answer sometimes after you act in obedience. And I was just like, well, here I am today. But yes, that is like essentially what I have to say today. And uh, by the time I upload this video, my my shop will be up. So if you're watching this video and you watch until the end and you feel led and you want to support the business, click the link below or you can go on my, my tab 
I feel like, I don't even know what it's called, but like on YouTube where my links are and you can click and find my, my shop there. And if you are interested, just support, cop a hoodie, cop two, share it with people who you think would like it. Man, share it with people who you think would like the hoodie if, if it's not your cup of tea. But yeah, like I'm just moving in obedience and I'm, I'm very interested to see like the fulfillment of what's, what's next. I'm very interested to see how this is going to play out. It's your, like, me and you, we walk and do this together. Like, I don't know what's next. But, again, I'm just being obedient. And I just want to thank you guys for watching the video, supporting the channel, liking, commenting. Like, yeah, just doing all those things, engaging with the content, sharing it. Like, it doesn't go unnoticed. And I just want to thank you all for doing that. And, yeah, that is essentially all that I have. And... Yeah, comment below, comment below if this is something, if this is resonating with you, if there's something that you put down, that you, that you tried so hard to do, like in your own strength or partially with God, and it just kept on failing, but you feel like you're called to it. Like, tell me, let me know if you feel like this is resonating and you feel like God is telling you to pick it back up again, cast your nets again, but with him in the boat. Not by yourself or not with him partially in the boat, but him within the within the boat completely and directing the boat. Um, yeah, but let me know if this resonates. Make sure you like, make sure you comment, subscribe, and share the video. Share the video so it can get out to more people. And like, yeah, I would greatly appreciate that. But until next time, I will see you guys in the next video. All right.